Hey guys, it's CL749 back with the more Soccer Angel. So in the last episode, we got home from the beach and uh, we made breakfast and now it's you know, raining really, really hard and then Sayaka was going to tell us something about a headache but, you know, of course, Hikari silenced her covered her mouth and dragged her to the cab. So we were gonna fall, but then we saw this girl and we're like, oh my god, she must be Yuzuki. So, uh, yeah. There's no doubt about it. She's the dark angel that has been making our lives a living hell. Yet, she seems like a completely different person right now. Well, yeah, I mean, you know, Sayaka and Hikari do too. God is any trace of madness. All I see right now is an emotionless schoolgirl. Yuzuki, oh snap. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I mean, I don't think she'd do anything to you in the school, but I mean, if you smart your enemy, you don't blab out their name, you want, you know, sneak up on them and then wait for the right moment to strike. Her name falls out of my mouth. The moment I come to the realization. Has she always been at this school? How did I not notice something as obvious as this before? Our eyes look across the clouds. Our eyes rock across the clouds. I fear something terrible is going to happen. And Dren says in, But her gaze quickly flickers away before she carries on about her business. Huh? She was so intent on getting me before, and now she wants nothing to do with me? Something isn't adding up here. I know it's a stupid and reckless thing to do, but I can't help but chase after it. <clears throat> if I go against Sayaka and Hikari, she might be gone by then. It's hard to keep up with her as the ways of students Crash against me. Everyone here friends eating at their lunch. But I just around managed to get a glimpse of her hiding before the staircase. You think he wait? She pays me no mind and continues to ascend the stairs. Why am I following her? I don't know what I can possibly get out of this beyond an early demise. Yet, I still insist on hiking up the stairs after her. She seems so different. Maybe I'm just secretly hoping that there's more to her than the initial crazed monster that confronted us two times before. Something that will help me make sense of this mess. I reached the top floor, breathless after climbing the stairs two steps at a time. I peer out on the I'm blah, blah. I peer out into the corridor and try to see where she might have gone to. <sighs> Oh, <laughs>
But there's nothing. I'm sure I wasn't far behind though. So when she disappeared to? I mean, this is when the stairs in. Unless, would she really be out there? In this weather? I make for the staircase again and go up a short flight of stairs leading to the rooftop. The rain sounds more violent than ever outside. I can't possibly imagine someone willingly wanting to be out there. Well, I mean, in all honesty, I would. I love the rain. And before, before I had my accident, I used to love walking home in it. It was just so nice to walk home in the rain. Sometimes with my eye point in, just hearing the rain going down, you know. You pay no mind anything, just a calm walk in the rain to your house. It was very relaxing. But I have to check, just to be sure. I fight against the raging wind and heave open the door. And heave the door open. Y Yuzuki? And of course, thank you. Know, White shirt, rain, lines, chest. There she is, standing by the fencing, gazing over the town with a hand idly gripping the mesh. I like the background music, it's very, very calm. I know I say what I love about that. I know I say what I like a lot of background music. I really like instrumental pieces. I mean, I have a lot of music on my iPod, but I like instrumental pieces from games and other stuff like uh, battle themes and Pokemon. Um, Final Fantasy, that I enjoy those instrumental pieces. Alrighty, the rain has drenched her completely. Her silk uniform clinging to her skin. She seems completely unbothered by them, as if she doesn't feel the rain at all. I've only been out here for a second, and I can only feel the urge to feel the urge to sneeze, creep up, I can, and I can only feel uh, that I can only feel the urge to sneeze, creep up as the chilling rains ram as the chilling rain. Make sure it work for me. That sentence doesn't sound right, but okay. Yuzuki ignores me. The amber eyes vacant. At the very least, she doesn't seem hostile at the moment. Right now, I think the way has a more likely chance of killing me than she does. I take a step toward her, my foot splashing into a side of the moon puddle. She responds bluntly. I may as well be taking to a complete... I may as well be talking to a completely different person than the girl that went after my life. I think carefully before opening my mouth. 
While things are peaceful right now, it may take saying only one wrong thing to set her up. I don't think she'd be as fragile as Hikami would, but that's just me. But I can't be too reserved on what answers. After hesitating for a moment, my voice initially coming out in the croak, I finally confronted her. I... Why are you sad on killing me? Why are you so sad on killing me? I don't understand any of this. What I mean is... Why me? She turns it up for a moment and the sound of my voice. I feel I might have said the wrong thing already, but she gradually relaxes again. What? Has she really been in the same class as me? I'm sure when I'm pieced together things a lot sooner if that were the case. Well, I mean, way, 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 way back. And you pumped in there. You see, let's have um, You soon see, let's have a better laugh. I, I'm not sure I. It sounds like her, um, her voice act, I believe it's an actress. I like her voice actress kind of better than the other two. This is my opinion, and it would kind of be really funny if it was the same person for all three. I haven't really done any research on this. Her grip tightens on the fence. The wire is sinking into her flesh. What is she talking about? I... Mm, yeah, that's what... Wow, usually... Kids like to be ignored. Chisanakotokamoshirenakido。何年もそういうことが続いて、少しずつ憎しみが湧くようになったわ。人は傲慢で、失礼で自分勝手だと。あなたは好感があるでしょう。なぜ友達を作る努力をしないのか。I I guess I'm not in from the mind. All I can do is stand and listen as she continued, ignoring the urge to shimmer. <laughs>試してみなかったとでも思うの。一生懸命話そうともしてみた。社交的にね。でも、特にグループは出来上がっていて、待って入れない壁が作られてしまっていた。私の挨拶は無視され、話しかければ白い目で見られた。家に帰り暗闇の中で一人座りまた学校へ戻らなければならないことに耐えた人々がいる場所こそ私にとって一番孤独な場所だった友達が欲しかったは何でもいいおしゃべりできる友達がねテレビ番組みたい So she's just lonely. And the rain stopped. But I'm running out of time, so peace out. Hope to see you all next video. Like, dislike, comment, subscribe.